15 лет. Белуга. Now I came to a premium restaurant which has for 20 years never lost its popularity since 1999. Many times it was awarded as the best restaurant in St. Petersburg, Russia and in 2014 New York Times listed this as one of the most unusual restaurants in the world. It is called Ruske Rybalka, Russian Fishing. It is located on Kristovsky Island of St. Petersburg, which has always was a great area. The thing is that here they have their own ponds with uh, different kinds of fish. You can catch it and uh, eat it right away. Your catch is the main dish. That's their motto. Let's see how it all works. Ilya Mikhailovich, the general manager of the restaurant. Now, together with him, we will go to the pond, where is uh, many kinds of fish. Always fresh and healthy fish. В этом году 20 лет ресторану Русская рыбалка. Летом будет большой праздник. Можно запланировать приезд на лето на июнь месяц, 21 июня. Очень удачный день. Вот. Мы идем ловить рыбу. 20 лет. Yes, 20 years is a huge term for a restaurant. Здесь аккуратнее. You see this pool uh, divided for many zones, different kind of fish. Beluga, the biggest fish here. Big. That's if you want to come to the restaurants with a big company of friends. Обычно здесь не сложно поймать рыбу, потому что ее очень много, места мало, да? Да, зависит от погоды, от давления, от перепадов. Летом рыба не ловится, потому что вода горячая для форели. 20 градусов выше, все уже, она плохо ловится. Сейчас зимой она очень короткая. Среди зимы в центре города. Да, все. Это прям как свежий улов. Getting this to the kitchen, where the cook will prepare this. Нагревается, начинает клеить, идет процесс копчения. Got inside of the restaurant. This is a two-story wooden house. Domestic atmosphere. All the house made of such a long log, uncalibrated cedar, and large. Terrace. In the summertime, it's pretty great here. The photographs of all famous guests who have been here, including Vladimir Putin, the second floor. I like this place. Шикарно, спасибо. It looks so good. Olivia salads, the most popular salads in Russia, definitely. It is also known as winter salads. Delicious. Oh. 
soup, which is in Russian we call uha, but in English it is called cream soup in Finnish with smoked trout and pie. Pie is here. Also together with this I've got horseradish tincture and pickle. Looks yummy, dudes. Horseradish tincture. And it's going to be spicy for my throat. Pickle on a stick. Oh. Looks good. Спасибо. This is for the first time I'm gonna try uh, smoked trout. Well done, you did a great job. Thanks so much. Wow, it looks delicious. Just a pure trout filet on my plate. Gentle filet without any bones. You like this experience of having filet, smoky filet of trout. We Russians, mostly we live far from the sea and we got used to eat uh, animals meat, like uh, mostly beef because we have a lot of cows on the endless fields of Russia. Well, maybe the guys in the city of Vladivostok, which is close to the Chinese border to the sea, maybe they are eating this more frequent. But let's say I lived in a Bashkortostan most of my life and uh, we have a lot of animals there. So I've got used to a beef and we love not a raw or medium raw. But we love such uh, like, you know, medium well or well done kind of meat. So now when it's smoky, it seems to me like this is, you know, it's, it's really by taste very close to an animal's meat. But at the same time, less calories. And I absolutely don't feel any, uh, anything like I, I never got used to this taste or so. The taste is great, you know. I eat it with a huge enjoy. Also, it helps a lot when you know what exactly fish it is, how it was grown up, where, how it looked like, and that it's fresh and healthy and um, gets on your plate as soon as you caught it on a pond next to the restaurant. This is good. No wonder the restaurant never lost popularity for 20 years just think about it 20 years man homemade sea backthorn drink tastes good dessert that is called hedgehog in fog Really, this marshmallows looks like a hedgehog with a strawberry. Now, this is like an old Russian tea brewed on a different grasses. Tastes good and sweet enough even without a sugar. And that's what is inside of hedgehog. Raspberry jam. Well, guys, again, I've got much more than I was really need. But again, just to show you a wider variety of the things that you can get in this restaurant. However, if it will keep going like this, I really will become really fat 
and maybe even will bankrupt if I will eat that often in a places like this. Because my final check, final receipt is 4,620 bucks. Uh, rubles. <laughs> bucks? Rubles, which is 70 bucks. But it was worth that. Beluga. 